backpack one is to pack your backpack the night before because a lot of kids forget to pack their backpack in the morning and that mostly happens to me the night before and then um, I am late for school. So I recommend to pack your backpack the night before then keep your backpack in a place that you will find it easily by your doorstep or something because this will be actually easy if you're actually running late for school and you can just grab it and go. So the so this is a really good life hack everybody, every school kid should do. For life hack two, it's for the mornings and is to put your alarm clock across the room. And I know everyone wish they have the superpower to turn off their alarm when they immediately get up, but it's impossible. So if you put your alarm clock across the room, all you have to do is just roll out of your bed and then crawl to your alarm clock and turn it off. Hopefully you do not fall asleep after you turn it off, but you'll get up and go. Now, hack three is pretty much something that happens to lots of people in my class. Is you drop a pencil and then suddenly, a couple of minutes later, your blue pen magically disappears. And this is a life hack if that happens. So you need a red pen and a blue pen. And what you have to do is actually change the ink out of the pen. So you take the red ink out of the red pen and then the blue ink out of the blue pen and then you put the blue ink inside of the red pen because no one likes red pens, sorry teachers. But you can do that and no one will steal your pens anymore. So hack number four is actually really helpful. It is to color code your school supplies. I know this might sound ridiculous, but it actually really helps because there would be a time that you go to your locker and you forgot to get something and you need to get it now. So I color code my school supplies so it'll be easier to get and it will be so easy to find in my locker. So hack number five is actually a hack from Meg D'Angelo, so thank you. So one day in class you notice a kid has your pencil that you bar let them borrow the other day and they just act like it's not theirs, like what the heck? And then here's a hack for that. So what you need is washi tape any color and scissors and your pencil. So what you have to do is take a strip of any, of any washi tape, then cut your washi tape and then wrap it around your pencil. Then when you wrap it around your pencil, it's actually really helpful so you know it's your pencil. So when you see the person, they would be caught red-handed with your pencil. Well, they won't do that though. So hack number six is, mostly has to relate to your schedule, so you put your schedule in your backpack and like a couple minutes you realize that's the wrong choice because when you're in the hallway you try to find which class you're going to and your schedule's in your backpack and you can't get the freaking schedule out of your backpack and you are failed so what you need for this hack is a, your schedule your your phone or your ipad if you can't bring your um phone to class so what you do is lay out your schedule and then take a picture on your phone or ipad and this is actually the easiest hack ever and I thought I, I wish I had thought of this in the beginning so what you do is go to your photos and then put it as your wallpaper and this is so genius because I get lost which class I have to go to next then you just make it your lock screen and it's genius so when you get lost in the hallway you actually don't have to get the paper schedule out you can just um, get out your phone and see your schedule. Then you're off to class. So hack seven is if you're having struggle with your math homework, and this is in my case, the hardest things I have ever done in my entire life is math. So what you do is go on Google and type up math is fun and this is actually helpful, helpful in my opinion. If it doesn't help you, it's fine. So you go to math to mathisfun.com and then you can look up anything like you can look up algebra and get information on the exponents and you can actually show you and they actually have a calculator 
uh, for exponents, which I never saw before. And you can also go to different grade levels all the way to 11th grade, Algebra 2, and I think this is a genius. And um, this usually helps me understand a lot of math. So hack eight is to drink water in the morning instead of coffee because it wakes you up quicker. And I know girls will be like, oh my gosh, you can't drink coffee in the morning. Yes, you can. But it's scientifically proven that if you drink water, you'll wake up quicker. And I know this is original water. And I promise I drink original water. Thank you, Zora. And it would actually wake you up um, quicker. And this is really awesome hack. Hack number nine is to organize your locker of a locker shelf and I swear this will make your life even easier in school and you can use any single um, color you want. They have varieties of colors and this I actually use my locker shelf to put my binders in the bottom, notebooks on the top. I recommend to get the extra large one because you can put your binders on the top, not on the bottom I meant, and the small one actually you can only put the binders on the, on the top. So hack number 10 is something I really did in the beginning of middle school is if you have a free period, don't use it to just chat with your friends. Actually go to your locker because there's less people in that period or something. And I actually did this during vocab time and I swear if you went in original hours, there would be people on the, on the bottom lockers and the top lockers getting their stuff and procrastinating stuff. And you just want to give up, so make sure to go on your free period. It will be actually easier in your life.